All right, so Gears 5 versus Tech Test on the PC. Uh, there is a long period of wait time. I'm still waiting. I've been waiting for like 25 minutes. Now I have one more minute left. Here we go. You do have to wait till you go inside the server to try this out. Uh, that's the only way because the servers are full. Everyone's trying to get in. So without any further ado, let's go ahead. Let's do this. Resolution is 3840. By 1080, I'm using two dual 240 hertz monitors. I'm running the uh, Radeon RX 5700 XT 50th Anniversary Edition graphics card. And let's see how well it runs. Let's see how good this is. I want to see if there's any problems. Is there's any like glitches, bugs, stuff that I can report. So let's go ahead. Let's check it out. All right, so we'll leave it like that. Let's continue. I don't know if they're going to support ultra wide here. I, I don't know. We'll see. I think they should. Welcome to a boot camp. Thank you for playing. Before you experience the campaign, compete in versus Outlast in Swarm of Hordes or outrun them in the escape. Let's go through the basics and show you some of the latest gameplay updates. Available, Gears 5, enjoy. Press start. Lieutenant Delmont Walker, reporting for duty. Yo, Bear, how long is it gonna stay dark in here? We dark. where are you? Where you told me to go. Oh dear, miscommunications. Dave, uncloak. All right, can you at least see Dave? All right, let's look up. All right, I see Dave. Oh, that's good. All right, that's good. Yeah, I see Dave. All right, we're gonna get that module powered up. You just hurry. Ah, lights are glitched. Iris, open the doors. Certainly, Damon. Oh yeah. Tell me again why you got me out of my perfectly good bed for this. Alright. I want to upgrade our security bots for combat against the swarm. Everything you do, the sensors on your armor will record. Man, you think your boss is going to be able to compile my moves? Uh, yeah. I do, actually. This looks pretty good, man. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> this is fast. Oh man. Oh yeah. I'm already happy, dude. Hold on. I'm already happy. This looks pretty good, dude. I love how responsive and fast this is. You know, again, this is the beauty of having the uh, AMD graphics card. This is designed for this AMD Radeon 5700 XT. It's gonna work the best with the AMD. They even advertise it in the beginning of when you start the game. Look. This right here, it's already good to go, man. I don't see any issues. I don't see any problems. Smooth, barely any like input lag, man. This is, look, look. Super smooth, man. Super smooth. Super fast. Can't wait to play the PC version. You know, guys, I'm gonna be playing a PC version. Sorry. I mean, I love this. I love this smoothness. I love how fast this is. Dave, 
All right, let's. Yeah, baby. This is awesome, dude. Let's continue. You know, liberate. Irish, activate the sprinting trench. Certainly, Damon. Just look how responsive that is, like on a control. Look at this. And, uh, man, uh, look. Playing this on the dual 240 hertz refresh rate monitors. Uh, with this AMD graphics card, this is smooth, you know. Uh, regroup with Dave. And this also gives me some idea what we can expect to see with this game on uh, Scarlet, because I'm pretty much using the same Navi architecture that's going to be utilized with Xbox Scarlet. And look how fast this is, man. This is a totally different Gears of War, guys. Forget the Gears of War 4. This is like a totally new experience, man. And it looks and it plays so far so great, man. Look how fast that is, dude. You don't even see how fast this is because my camera is only recording in 30 FPS. If you were to see this in person, dude, you would be just... Well, you know what? Why don't you try it out for yourself? If you have 240 hertz monitor, if you have this graphics card, go ahead and try it out for yourself. Alright, Dave. Where's Dave? Oh, there he is. Alright, let's do it. Come on. Ready? Come on. Not bad. Too slow, Dave. All right, good job. Data's clean. 
Let's continue. And the quality, I mean, listen, the graphics, they look really good, man. This Unreal Engine 4, the textures, I like what I'm seeing here, man. This just looks amazing, dude. And it's super fast. Dude, I cannot tell you how fast this is, man, and how smooth it is. Okay, grab a Lancer, the COG's most trusted and versatile firearm. Man, how could you not trust something with a chainsaw, man? All right, kid, incoming guardians. Take down their shields and destroy them. All right. Okay, now aim down your sights. Maybe you love to hit fire. We need to change that. Now we're on fire again. Dude, I'm loving it, man. Let me tell you, bro. I'm freaking loving it. Now, let's try using blind fire to destroy them while you're being self-protected in cover. Unit operational. Use my assistance to fire. And act the reload. Oh, perfect. It's gotta be solid day to day. Not bad, not bad. But let's up the challenge. Can you take down a moving target? Unit online. Citizen, how may I help you? So L B and R T. Wait. Hold the LT and RT to shoot. I don't know what happened. My controller stopped working. I don't know what's going on. Okay, grab a Lancer. The dog's most trusted and versatile firearm. Man, how could you not trust something with a chainsaw bayonet? All right, kid. Incoming guardians. Take down their shields and destroy them. Are you on board? Okay, now aim down your sight. Babies love to hit fire. We need to change that. I know how to fire a gun, Baird. Am I looking, Baird? Exactly, right? There. Now let's try using blind fire to destroy them while keeping yourself protected in cover. You're in operational. Use my assistance to fire. Now that's good data. Put that in your thing. Nice. For some goddamn reason, Davies have trouble nailing a perfect reload. Show them how it's done. Oh, perfect. It's gotta be solid data there. Not bad, not bad. But let's up the challenge. Can you take down a moving target? All right. I'm loving this training. This training so good, man. 
so far, man, I'm digging it, dude. I like the way it plays, and I'm sure you guys will see it, will notice it here as well. I need some I need some more frag, hold on. Let's do it. I think I got enough. I'm good. I'm loving this game. It's really exceeding my expectations. I'll be honest with you right now. Nice. Was great, dude. Thanks, kid. Don't worry, I'll make sure it gets recycled. Head over to Dave when you're ready to continue. Dude, right, well, let, let me tell you guys, my first impressions are right now real good, bro. I, I'm digging this game. You'll just have to trust me, this looks so much better when you were playing it on a 50 inch dual screen, or if you got 75 inch. Uh, triple screen let me tell you man it's just it's the PC version it just feels smoother you know there, there's something about that smoothness and fastness that you're not gonna see on your console dude you're just not gonna experience that on the Xbox One X playing it on a PC is just like 
it's like that's how it's at least to me that's how it's meant to be played with a high frame rate with a high refresh rate it just feels more more immersive it feels more exciting and i think that's what we're going to get with the scarlet you know but overall you're going to have a good 4k hdr 60 fps experience on the xbox one x don't get me wrong but the pc version it's where this thing will shine because this game it's all about multiplayer right so you want to compete in the multiplayer well you're going to need that performance and this is where the pc comes in let's look at the options let's look at uh what we have available here in terms of video uh i have recommended 3840 by uh maximum frame rate unlimited field of view All right, so and look how fast that is, man. Just look. Grab a dash your shotgun off the rack. Where's the shotgun? I know I'm gonna like this. All right, let's grab the shotgun. Let's do it. Me work, baby. All right, let's do it. Come on. Good to see you, citizen. All right. Oh, dude, this is so much smoother. Nice. Dude, it is Again, this is what I was saying. This is why I prefer to play it on PC, because this is the way it was meant to be. To eliminate that input lag, to eliminate that response time, to give you that nice refresh rate, and also to give you that much better frames per second performance. So yes, the PC version is going to be the best way to play this game this September. For those of you who have the luxury that have a PC. Now, if you don't have a PC, I understand. I'm not here to, to say, oh, you got to have a PC. I understand. But you got to remember, this is a fact. The fact is you're going to have a better performance on the PC. You're going to have a better performance while you're using the uh, 240 hertz refresh rate or and while you're using the uh, AMD's uh, RX 5700 50th anniversary edition graphics cards. Because this game is designed with AMD and they even advertise it on the AMD uh, uh, briefing floor. Rod Ferguson was there. I cannot wait to play this man in September. I'm loving it, dude. Almost feel sorry for Hey, with learning comes sacrifice. Now, mantle into the next area. Same drill. Get into cover opposite the shepherd, but line it up, mantle over, knock it back. And insert knife. 
too. This is so awesome. Got some more weapons here. Nice. Shot grenade. Oh yeah. I don't like this one. I like this one. Hold on. Oh yeah, retro lancer, dude. I love this shit. So this video is going to end pretty soon. Um, I want to say a couple of things. Uh, number one, as you can see in this half an hour video, my first impressions is that, man, this runs really fast and runs really smooth. Uh, I'll probably do a 1080p 60 video on my next uh, video. But so far, what I have seen here, what I have experienced, this is ready to go. They could release this game tomorrow. Uh, and you don't even have to wait till September, man. This is super smooth. The graphics are very sharp, and it runs really great, man. It runs really steady, no bugs, no issues, at least on a PC, on the AMD. So, Coalition, great job, man. This this is like a brand new Gears experience. You know, a lot of people been shitting on this game without actually trying it out, and this is what I always hate about certain individuals is they would shit on the game without even trying it out all right i don't care that they have a female lead character forget about that i'm talking about the overall gameplay experience and what i'm seeing here so far it's pretty 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 darn good my first impressions are pretty 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 darn good man and you guys, once you try this out, you will be impressed too. But you have to remember, if you have AMD Radeon card, and if you have a 240 hertz refresh rate, or even 144 hertz refresh rate, you're gonna you're gonna just appreciate it much better, dude. You're gonna appreciate this game hell of a lot more. I guarantee you, dude. I kid you not. I haven't noticed any issue, any slowdown. Everything loads up quickly and fast. So, very happy. So, there you have it. My first impressions are awesome. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, this half an hour video. Thank you, though. Cheers.